and we are almost finished with this goddamn Christmas thing. And today, as you can see, we're playing Gundam Seed Never Ending Tomorrow. Perhaps the only non Universal Century Gundam game for the PS2. One of the only non Universal Century games for the PS2 to be released. for the. to ever be released in. One of the few non Universal Century Gundam games to ever be released in the US, actually. So it doesn't have any of the stuff from the original Gundam series, just this n new one about a bunch of prepubescent kids killing each other. So what's the story of th this game? With this Gundam series, I'm... Oh God, why do I get up so early to do these? Well, in this universe, there are a bunch of these dudes who m modify themselves and call themselves coordinators, saying, hey, we got can do stuff better, and all the normal people are like, hey, you're different, you're evil, we kill you, and they killed a whole bunch of them, and so they moved into space. But the natural's like, yeah, we want to kill you all, and then they blow up one of their colonies, and all and the co coordinators are like, all right, we're got, we've had enough of this bullshit, and they make their their, their f the very first mobile suits and curb stomp most of the naturals, and then the naturals made their Gundams. And then, unfortunately, they Z Zaft, the Zaft is the organization run by the coordinators, and they find out that like, oh shit, they're building stuff better than ours. Let's go steal it, and they steal four of the Gundams. But then this one prepubescent kid, the one right there next to the option screen, he pilots the fifth one. And they have to fight him, and it's bad because one of the stolen Gundams is piloted by his old friend Atherin Zala. Oh no, it's a calamity and stuff. So basically, it's like the first Gundam series, except the. The Earth guys are just as big as douchebags as the space guys. So there's no one likable, except a few of the main characters. Unfortunately, this game's really terrible. It's not that good. I haven't been playing as the Earth Alliance storyline, because the Earth Alliance are fucking douchebags. They're, they're racist assholes, and it's their fault this whole war started, so who cares about them? I've been playing as Atherin. Unfortunately, I've reached a bit of a hard spot. Here, I'll show you. There's a stupid horror. This is the first game since the first one, uh, first series. Oh. I'm willing to give up their pursuit of the art. I really shouldn't show you that because YouTube's probably gonna throw a hissy fit about copyright shit. A ship is broken away from the Earth Forces fleet that's advancing into Orb's territorial waters. It's the Legged Ship. So the what? Zala team, commence attack! Today, the Legged Ship goes down! Yay, and shit. So yeah, we're pursuing the last Gundam, and, and Atherin's been, like, giving him a chance. Please select your partner. Silence! What the hell does... And we can select our partners. It doesn't really do anything, it just gives us a special ability. What's wrong with your hair? Dear God, that's ugly. Eh, yeah, alright. That'll do. Unfortunately, this game doesn't tell you how to play it at all, and you have to look at the controls, and even then it's still kind of... crappy. Prepare to attack! Yep. And I'll show you how terrible this game is. First off, we can't select our mobile suit in this mode. We have to, like, beat the game first, I guess. Which is kind of boring, because I've had to use the same mobile suit like 15 times already. Song, launching. Yeah, nice animation, buddy. Then you- Oh crap, oh crap, he's already found me, and there, there's the strike Gundam pilot. And then you get into these- Damn, damn it, they always do the- This is like one of the only ways to deal damage to this guy, because he's really resistant to your ranged weapons. Ow! Fucking asshole! As you can see, I'm getting my ass kicked already. Ow! Ow! You just mash the triangle button, that's it, and hope you get the upper hand, that's it. And I've somehow reduced him to half health already. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. And if we click the right analog stick, it uses our special skill. And this somehow damages him. Or it damages that thing up there. Oh, you freaking cunt! Get over here! We also have a special move! We can do this! Although, I think he just dodged that. 
And I'm almost dead, and whenever you almost die, this this happens. That weird seed thing that's in the title goes off and does that. Stop blocking, asshole! Just accept your fate! This game is so freaking ridiculous! Look at this! And I'm dead. How could you lose? No! Oh, for frick's sake. That went well, didn't it? Don't patronize me, game. <laughs> I've lost. God, what are you supposed to do there? Let's retry it. Yes, retry the damn thing. Don't uh, ask me uh, not to. So basically, you just get up close and mash the triangle button, which is the melee attack. Yeah, whatever. Who cares? Look, see, that's barely doing it. Well, actually, and some, and that happens every time you're strafing. It keeps the, unselecting it. Freaking prick! I'm gonna rape you! Ah! Ow! Stop doing that! My phase shift armor is supposed to perfect. And he dodged it again. Damn it! You pre present asshole! Why are they? Why do they have a bunch of teenagers piloting these? Atherin is probably around the same age as the pilot of the strike gun of Kira. So why is he? Why are they, are they using teenagers? Is it? Are they running out of adults? Ow! It was that bean boomerang that told me about in the briefing. Why the hell would you use a beam boomerang? Do they just think it sounded cool? Ow, st God damn it! Do something, Atherin, you incompetent fool! Uh, this is my least favorite of the Gundams they stole. I like the prefer the Blitz Gundam, and unfortunately that's going to get destroyed in this mission. Spoiler alert. You just die already, prick? Oh, God. The super duper mode, yay! Dear God, do your stupid thing. Let's go for a record score. What? This could be a problem. Yay! Yeah, thanks, Dear God. That was a huge help. Really turned everything in our favor now. Ow! Just kill! Oh, my phase shift is down. That's not good. Will you just die already, Kira, for crying out loud? Who th thought this was a good idea? Did no one test this game? Did no one say, hey, you know, maybe this is kind of sh this looks kind of shitty. Maybe we should f refine this bit. And they said, nope, we want to make money. Because this probably came out like a... Christ, this came out when the series was still young, I think. And I think that was like 15 years ago. That game's like 15 years... This Well, no, not this game. The series is like 15 years old. Holy shit. Came out in like 2002. Uh, try again. Stupid ass strike Gundam. And if all else fails, we can always try one of the Earth Alliance missions, although that's gonna be stupid too. Atherin's all a launching, blah blah blah. Come on, Kira, I'm gonna blast you with my super duper cannon. Oh, there you are. Haha, <laughs> that does a lot of damage, but you can only use it like twice, so. Stop unlocking on him! And then there are those stupid fighter things. I, I don't get the idea why they built those. Why don't you just build more Gundams or stuff? I don't want to fight you anymore. No, don't target them! God damn it, you freaking incompetent video game developer! Who the hell made this piece of shit? Sorry, sorry, that was my bad. Ow! Ah, target the Gundam, you dumbass! Ah, God damn it! Fucking controls! Oh yeah, go ahead and do that, Deerka. Those things would go get blown out of the air if they got hit by that. Target the damn Gundam! They, thank you. Oh, damn it, you missed! Okay, I'm just gonna run away. 
Finally! Come on, die, you bitch! There, th you can also play some other mo- Yes, finally! And then we're gonna get a cutscene. Oh no, it's the guy who I knew was going to die right from the start when I started this game, because I read the episode summaries for the show. You don't have to leave it there, you asshole! Take it out of the body! You're tormenting him, Kira, you fucking douche! Yeah, just everyone just stand there and do nothing. And let him die. Good one, Athron. And good one, Kira. Nicole! Oh, and that was a man. And his name was Nicole. I'm not kidding. Yeah, with a name like that, you're going to die, buddy. Sorry. Unfortunately, he was the only partner who could heal me. So without him, I'm kind of in a pickle. Nicole! And so Athron's pissed now, and he's going wants to kill Kira. Despite the fact that I almost killed him in the last stage. Ow! Ow. Okay, for the for this battle to be canon, I have that little fighter thing up there, that has to be destroyed. Come on, kill him, you douche! I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. Here, a deer cut, even though this is a one on one fight, give help me cheat and shoot that gut dude up there. My god, I killed it! What, what, who can listen to those stupid little conversations while we're in the middle of a goddamn battle? Nice shot, douchebag, you missed completely. Jesus. Do something! You just get locked into those stupid ass. Do something, you douchebag! Do something! You're in a fucking huge ass Gundam and you're just standing there taking it like you're fucking getting raped. Ugh. Who made thought that. Who decided to release this game in this state? It's terrible! Dear God, help me cheat again. For a record score. How is that thing still alive? Did you just block combo break me, you douchebag? Stop! Unselect- Great, now my cannon's out of ammo. Ow! Frickin' prick! I'll destroy you because we're not allowed to say kill because children might be watching. Stupid children ruining everything else for, for us adult fans. And I'm probably going to die again. God damn it, this game! And I'm dead again! God damn it! Who thought this was a good idea? There better be a goddamn checkpoint, or I swear to god I'm done with this game forever. Though to be fair, I'm probably never gonna play this game regardless. No, don't save the game. Don't record my failure. Oh my god, if you put me way back at the start of this and we're finished. You fucking whore. Don't you dare put me in at the start of that. Come on. Oh, thank Christ. Nicole! Eat super duper can ah, for cry out loud, you asshole! Come on, that's it, just get over. Oh no! Stay back! Ow, fucking cunt! Damn prepubescent assholes! I'm gonna rape every one of you until you're pu puberty. No, toll that other guy. Who gives a shit? I don't care anymore. Ow! Who did 
this this is a one on one battle. Knock it off. I have to avenge the death of Nicole, that one green haired guy who looks like a girl. What is it with the J Japanese ga anime and p guys who look like girls? That is so weird. Tierra heard from Gundam Double Zero, I thought was a girl when I first saw him. And I was like, holy shit, he's a dude! And despite that, he's still the coolest guy in the ga in the show. On, hit him, you freaking douche! God damn! Even Dynasty Warriors Gundam One was better than this garbage. Ow! Yes, go ahead and go into your super duper mode and shit. Crying out! How do you beat be good at this game? Help me cheat again, blonde no douche. Good score. And who's apparently Indian? Sorry to any Indian viewers. Oh, die, please, just die! I want to beat this level. Maybe will something interesting will happen if I beat it. Come on, that's it. That's it. No, no, no! Don't you dare kill me, Kira! I swear to God. Yes, thank you. Oh no, Deerka has been taken down. Oh no, he's captured. Oh, and Kira's pissed because we killed his friend just like we killed his. And we lost one of our legs, for, somehow. I'm going to destroy you! Yeah, I'm going to destroy you! Not allowed to say kill! Oh, my head! Ah! And he self-destructs his unit. And Kira's dead! Hooray! Except not really. He somehow survives that huge-ass explosion. And it's never explained. Well, they say there's a little plate that lowers in front of him, but that's it. Well, I think you can do a little better. Oh, fuck you, asshole! Did you see what was happening out there? You go in that mobile suit and tell me that's not easy hard. Fucking douchebags. And Deerka got captured. Great! You've gone up a lot! Yay! Probably never gonna play this game again after this, but let's see what happens next. Hey, thankfully, never have to use that piece of junk again. I hate that mobile suit, it's so ugly. Nico! After blowing up the Aegis, Athrun is rescued by the Orb Forces and encounters Kigali once again. His mind swirling with doubts, he returns to the plants as ordered. You <laughs> Your mission is to recover the stolen X-108 and eliminate this pilot. What is it you're fighting for now? Is it for that medal you received? Or for your father's order? Oh yeah, and that's his girlfriend. She becomes the girlfriend of Kira now. Thinking about now. Athrun Zala, justice launching! Is that Nicole? The Earth Alliance, led by the aggressive Atlantic Federation, has set its sights on Orb... Oh yeah, these are douche... Earth Alliance douchebags. They're why I don't like the Earth Alliance. When Orb refuses to cooperate, it is branded as a Zaft supporter. Yeah, see, they're massive douchebags who... They all deserve okay, to die. Boys, it's time for you to get out there and show us what you're made of. Oh yeah, and he's the he's like a demon. His name's Azriel, actually. He's the leader of the bad douche. Seriously, look at that asshole. You wanna rape that dude that face? Calamity. Raider. Oh, who cares? I wanna kill stuff! So now we finally got ourselves a di My orders from the homeland were to recapture the freedom or destroy it. Charged with this mission, I descended to Earth in the Justice. But upon my arrival, I saw that the Earth forces were fighting amongst themselves, divided into two factions. The conflict between the Orb forces and the Alliance fleet will only bring more confusion. But why? Why do they have to escalate the war? Why am I piloting Justice? Where do my true feelings lie now? And will it be truly worthwhile if I go onto the battlefield once again? Eh, probably, because you're piloting a Gundam that isn't actually shit this time. Hey look, we can actually choose some other douchebags. Who the hell are... Yeah, she's a douchebag and Kira. Ah, no, we aren't using him. Who gives a shit? 
And we can give him some non shitty st skills. Increases Berserk Gauge. I don't know what the hell a Berserk Gauge is. What the hell are you t talking about, game? Oh god, we have to protect the d damn super duper battleship. Okay, let's get this over with. We're almost finished with this damn video, and then I'll never have to play this pile of shit again. Why won't they make more, bring more Gundam games over here? They just released one for the first one over here for like five years. Gundam versus for the PS4. They never release anything else. Just this is that special forces after it's over. So finally, we get to fight some mass production models that are supposed to be shitty because that we can tear through with one shot, but apparently they're still just as cheap. This yellow fat Republican bastard. Yeah, sorry if two Republicans, but seriously, Republicans are aggressive assholes, and they're probably running this this world. All right, where's that other one? Oh, here he is. I wonder what my special does. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. Unfortunately, I'm never going to be able to do that again. Eat this, you bastard. They're just attacking a neutral nation because they're neutral. They're saying, that's like attacking Sweden because they didn't want to join in World War II. Seriously, these guys are worse than the space douche. Douchebags. Yay, this is fun. I'm having fun, aren't you? Oh no, it's the evil Gundams! And I wasted my fuck. What the hell was that? Use my stupid uh, backpack thing. Ow, ow. Ow. Move! Get off my ass, douchebag! I'll rape you with my beam sabers. I'm sorry I'm using the word rape a lot, but that's why I like to say to people I hate, I'm going to rape your ass until you die. Don't do that in real life, people. Raping is terrible. Ow. Ow! Don't you shoot your bazookas at me at point blank range, mister! Uh, Deerka, do something! I'll help you. Sound good? Berserk Gage, go! And stupid eye seed break thing. Ow, ow, ow. Oh god, slow down. Was that intentional? You freaking He's not taking any damage! What the hell? Fine, I'll kill your boyfriend then. I think this is a dude. One of these is a woman, I think. One of them's named Clotho after that one te uh What was it called? Sister of Fate from God of War, that's it. Stop! stop it. Do something, Atherin! Don't just stand there taking it like a bitch! Still wanna fight? Why were you shooting over there? I was locked onto this one! Stay locked on, you worthless, good-for-nothing targeting system! And I'm getting... Damn, this game! Did I win? Thanks for covering me. But I'm still wondering, what exactly are your two intentions? Oh, fuck you, Kira. Personally, I'd let the Earth Alliance blow itself Finally, up. the two friends meet again and have a chance to talk. Inspired by Kira's determination to fight to end the war, Diarka and Athrin decide to fight alongside him as well. The power of friendship! Yay! Who cares? Is to resist the Alliance's might, Uzumi sacrifices his life to ensure that the Archangel escapes into space to continue the fight for peace. Yeah, fuck you, Earth Alliance. 
No drama, who cares? Dear God, this game's awful. Well, I think you can do a little- Oh, shut up! You don't know how hard it is, fuckwad. And Deer Guy probably gets a level up, or... Yeah, he levels up. And... Why can't we have more Gundam games over here? Boost capacity increased. Hey, oh, good, the shop has new stuff, too. There's stuff that... I, like, new mobile suits that I can't use. Oh, God, this game. Oop, I'm done with this game forever. So what's the lesson today? If you're going to... Go to war with a space fleet, do some... S make sure your mobile suits don't get stolen, otherwise they're gonna fuck you in the ass. If you've got some evil guy with the last name of some an archangel leading your forces, you might want to shoot him in the face the next time you see him. And when we come back, we'll do the final Christmas Advent thing, so I'll be done with this forever. So I'll see you then.